Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. We're blessed today again to celebrate this Saturday in honor of the Blessed Virgin Mary, to renew our love for Our Lady and our consecration to her, our dependency on Our Lady and the Gospel. Today we have the reading where the woman says, Blessed are you, blessed is the woman who gave you, who nursed you and, and reared you. And Jesus said, but rather blessed are they who hear the word of God and keep it. And Our Lady certainly did that. She heard the word of God and kept it perfectly, perfectly. And when we pray to Our Lady, we are praying to her, especially to hear the word of God and keep it so that she teaches us how to do the will of God. Certainly Our Lady is always concerned about us doing the will of God and only about doing the will of God. So as we pray to Our Lady, we're not praying for our own will. We pray to Our Lady the same way we pray to God. And uh, we, we, with that caveat, your will be done, not mine. Your will be done, Mary, not, not mine. And when we pray, we should always have that intention to pray for God's will to be done in our life, which we know is always the best for us. And we know, as St. Maximilian taught, that when we do God's will as perfectly as we can, we will become saints. To be a saint is to do God's will. So our quest in life, our seeking, our desire, our yearning should be for God's will. What is God's will? How do I discern God's will? How do I find it? And God's will for me is going to be different for, for other people most of the time because we have different life circumstances and different duties and different um, situations that are going to call for, call for you know, God's will to be applied in a different way. So we always have to discern you know, what God's will is for ourselves. You know, of course, we ask counsel what God's will it would be for us in different difficult situations, but a lot of times we have to discern it on our own with Our Lady's help, and so that's why we turn to Our Lady to help ask her to help her help us to know what God's will is and to have the grace to put it into practice. So Our Lady is all about God's will, and we should be all about God's will, seeking it, desiring it, figuring it, figuring it out through God's grace and praying for enlightenment more and more because we will become holy only if we do God's will, if only if we do Our Lady's will. So we ask, so we ask Our Lady to help us to focus and center us ourselves more on God's will today. <laughs> 